Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. Yes, good talk, Nazir. I think you're right. We have to do something about Cicero. He's too annoying. It's time for him to go. And I think I may have an idea about how I can take care of that. Enjoy your this loaf of bread. Is already starting to feel like home. I bet it, it must is. Be all the blood stains. Enjoy that loaf of bread while I take care of Cicero. Cicero. Cicero is at your service, oh great and powerful listener. I command you to accompany me. Oh yes, Cicero and the listener. <laughs> On the hunt. <laughs> let's go. All right, let's ride, Cicero. Uh-oh. There's a chance to test your combat skills. Two trolls. Wow, and a saber cat. All right, let's discover this location here. Refugees rest, okay, and let's get ready to fight. Where's that cat? Dead? Or did it run off? And he says to the man, It's not a horker. That's my wife. <laughs> oh, I love that one. I bet you do. What's this? First hold revolt. Doesn't seem to be anything important. What is this tower? Is there nothing here either? Hmm. Well, at least there's something for my trouble. Garnet gold, soul gems, ruby ring. Let's go. Your chattering is really starting to get on my nerves. Now, if I can't lure Cicero here, this could be a problem. Hail, cultist. I am the Nightingale. No one crosses me. You there, Dear Lord Boethius, faithful. Have you come to test your metal? Who is Boethia? The oh, Lord there of he is. Plots. Deceiver of nations, devourer of Trinomark, the queen of shadows, goddess of destruction, he who destroys, and she who erases. Many are our lord's lofty names, but they befit only us mortals. 
Intone her mighty names from now until the end of time. It is for yeah. not. Names mean nothing to our Lord. She only cares for those who care for themselves, whose hearts are full of purpose, whose lives are full of deeds. <laughs> is this some kind of cult? We are forged by Boethia's example. We carve our will upon the world through our tongues and our blades. You, you are nothing. An empty vapor dispersed by the slightest breeze. I'm not afraid of you. Good. Perhaps I've misjudged. Engage in this contest. You Boethius faithful. Have you come to test your metal? It looks like there's only one way to get through to you, and that would be by saying that my heart is full of purpose and my life is full of deeds. If you desire a glimpse of our dark mistress, then this is what you must do. First, move your tongue and wield a lie. Find someone. Gain his trust, lead him to the shrine above. Next, instruct your thrall to touch the pillar of sacrifice. Its magic will ensnare him, rendering him helpless. Then, girded with certitude, grant the ceremonial blade deeply so that the waters of his heart wash over you. If your will is strong enough, it will stir Boethia in her dark mind. And she will appear before us. I'll do it. That remains to be seen. But if it is so, and if Boethia appears, then we will welcome you as one of us. You won't even live to regret this! Cicero, I hope you didn't hear any of that. Come on, follow me. That's it. With pleasure, my listener. I'm always eager. All right, did it matter what I used to kill him? A well-placed word or a well-placed dagger, both can achieve equal purposes. <laughs> Cicero? It's time that you left this plane of existence. You have been nothing but an annoyance to me and everyone else in the Dark Brotherhood. Die! Die! <laughs> Sacrifice. Cicero. I had to kill all of the cultists as well. 
you. Well done. You have proven the strength of your will and your tongue's gift for lies. You have shown ferocity and prowess in combat. Now the time has come for a final proving. Are you able to cast aside your honor and strike with the hidden blade? Honor is a coward's tool. An astute observation. Skyrim is a beautiful and harsh mistress, but her people cling to such a petty notion of honor. My previous champion displeases me. It is time he is replaced, in the traditional fashion. Who is he? I am loath to utter his name. One cannot erase a thing if it has a name to be remembered. Where can I find him? You will find him holed up at Knife Point Ridge, where he plays king to bandits and highwaymen. What has he done to displease you? For a time, he served his purpose, but that time has ended. He uses my gifts for his own amusement, and the only amusement I tolerate is my own. <laughs> Say no more. He's as good as dead. Kill every single member of his band. Do so as silently and invisibly as you can, for this is not about you. You are to be my instrument in this. Slay him in the coldest of blood. Do not give him the dignity of defending himself. Once his corpse lays cold upon the ground, and all trace of his followers erased, retrieve my ebony mail, a gift fit only for my true champion. Hmm. Cicero is still alive. All right, it doesn't matter. He won't be able to escape a Boethia's power. <laughs> Now, you foolish jester. Now is the time you should be laughing. Because I'm laughing at you. In your face. <laughs> All right, I've arrived at Knife Point Ridge. Huh. So they're gonna dump rocks? For your like. Take this and hold on to it. Oh, are you I'll kidding me? Later. I'll pay you good. Don't lose it. I'm in the middle of something. No time to talk. Snitch or double cross me and I'll kill you. I mean it. No. You're not the one that's doing the killing. <laughs> Did you go? Looks like we got ourselves a hero. Split your belly and hold your back. All right, who's next? Is 
still, did the fugitive get away? Was that him? I don't know. Over here. Ah, here he is. Did you see someone run past just now? No. You can see that he's lying dead right next to my feet. How dare you! Well, if you do, grab him and yell. Bastard stole from me. Until next time. Someone else is about to steal from you, and it's your life, idiot. Really, someone do something for what reason? Where are you? Somebody help. Is it just these two? spell is going to prevent me from killing you. You can send whoever you want at me. No one can survive the wrath of the Nightingale. No one! Hmm. This is not my target. killed him, but it's no matter. Staff... <clears throat> Excuse me, Staff of Gravisphere? Wow, that's interesting. To me, my bow. out. No. Let's do something else. Since you're using ice, how about some fire? Is 
this my illusion spell? What the hell? Don't know why he's glowing like that. Uh, we don't really need those. I still don't know how he heard me. It's amusing to see someone that's calling themselves an assassin to be so easily felled by someone who actually is. Just taken the armor and left him alive. But what's the fun in that? done well, my champion. You have earned my respect. A feat few manage and live to tell about. I shall write your name upon the tablet of absolute darkness. Excellent. You may keep my ebony mail, a token of my appreciation to my new champion. Its gifts will resonate with your talents. Now go. I have strings to pull that require my full attention. You may pursue your own course wherever it leads you. Remember always this. As you will it, so it shall be. Yes. Yes, excellent. <laughs> well... This armor is way too heavy for me, but as long as Boethia is happy for now. So this is it. Is Cicero truly dead? I've got to go back to Boethia's temple and find out. Hmm. No sign of his body. to go back to the sanctuary and make sure that he is truly gone. Alright, I don't hear any singing. God 
No! No! Someone. No!